Hey guys and welcome to a new channel updates video and what I want to talk about is that I have been playing a lot with these two and a lot of you guys have been sending me messages asking me when, when are you going back to CDI so that's why we're here I got my CDI controller here so let's turn it on and play some CDI What the hell? Well, as you can see, that doesn't really work at the moment, and that was my problem. It turns out that the timekeeper battery in the CDI has gone dead, and when that happens, you cannot play the thing anymore. It's a really a very poor design flaw in the CDI players. When the timekeeper battery dies, it will give all kind of bugs from uh, well this kind of thing to not booting up at all and well some other stuff you can see some distortion in the screen too. And yet yeah, not very nice of the thing because it will not play any disc at all. I mean you can play uh, you can you can actually go to exit and it will just reboot and jump right back into the memory screen. And there is nothing in there, as you can see it's empty, but uh, yeah, since it's now empty it sort of messes up. And this will go over eventually, and I actually didn't think it would take this long, because after a while it will just act normally, and then it will uh, just boot up the discs uh, again, but uh, yeah, until then you cannot do anything with it, and it really sucks. Uh, one problem is once it starts doing uh, booting up CDs again one thing you cannot do is save games anymore because you know the battery is empty and that is really the battery that uh, governs the save files so that's a bit of a problem since most of the CDI games I cannot stand long enough to uh, play through in one sitting so that's gonna suck uh, yeah I do have some other players and I might go ahead and just dig one up uh, soon enough to you play some smaller games I guess and make a review out of those because that is a possibility uh, one problem I have with those is that uh, well they are in this stack of boxes and I'm kind of fed up with <laughs> digging through that stuff uh, to try and find exactly what I want because it's a lot of boxes and uh, it takes a while it's, it's really frustrating uh, not in the game room uh, at the moment but yeah I'll do that uh, also they are a lot bigger than the uh, this version because I use the uh, 470 version for uh, now my screen goes all messed up the, free, the 470 version of CDI which is uh, still quite bulky but you know the uh, 220 and 210 models they are really freaking huge so yeah I will try and get some CDI stuff up again and in the meantime uh, do something else and uh, yeah that's uh, about it for CDI stuff so uh, sorry there's nothing much, it's been like this since January and I really didn't expect it to take this long to uh, dry up at all but you know apparently it does take longer than I thought, oh well. Uh, don't go yet, don't go yet because I have another small thing to uh, discuss real quick and that is that uh, I recently became YouTube partner and uh, I was actually, well, really surprised that uh, that I got that position um, because I was in a bit of a silly mood and sent in a really really <laughs> ballsy and kind of weird application and yeah somehow they uh, they accepted it and uh, they asked me for my number and they actually called me who knew YouTube still used phones I didn't know but well they did <laughs> and uh, yeah so uh, I got YouTube partner and I was really surprised but uh, I really have to thank each and every one of you very much for all the support you've been giving me because if it wasn't for you then I would have never had this chance so really guys thank you so much for just being here as uh, viewers and I really appreciate your comments and uh, suggestions and all that even though I don't come to all of these suggestions but uh, I do try to and I want to uh, really get more behind that and I want to especially thank now Chipsters and the Video Game Geek as they have primarily, uh, well, sort of set the way for me in the world of being a partner. Uh, will this have any changes to the channel? Well, 
not really, at least I hope not. Uh, well, there is some design changes of the channel and a banner of course, but uh, that's all very minor. I do hope to actually make more videos now and... Well, one question you might have is, will there be ads? And yes, I will share, I will opt into the uh, ad revenue sharing uh, option. Uh, simply because, you know, these, these reviews take a lot of time to make and when there is a chance for getting something back for that, then I'm going to just take it. Uh, however, I do want to really give something back to all the subscribers that have been uh, subscribed to me already. So what I'm going to do is that I will upload the videos normally and will not enable ad, uh, ads at all um, for at least one day and maybe two I will see about that. Uh, but just the first day at least it will have no ads on there. Also something uh, you can just do and I'm just going to say this now because you are my subscribers. Uh, if you're using Firefox then just use Adblock Plus and you will have no ads on YouTube at all so <laughs> that's an option uh, which you can use and uh, yeah. Also I am not going to uh, ask for subscribers and whatnot because I see a lot of YouTubers to do that and YouTube actually suggests that you do that. but. Uh, I personally am very annoyed when people do that. I've really literally unsubscribed from some channels that just keep asking for subscribers. Uh, I think if your content is good enough, people will subscribe. If it's not, then they won't. And you know, I, I don't want to ask anyone for subscribing. If you want to, then go ahead. If you don't want to, well, we're still gonna be just as good of friends as uh, that way. It's no problem for me really. I'm not about the numbers and uh, yeah, I don't find people stupid enough to not find the subscribe button if they like content. <laughs> I mean, I can find it, so uh, others can too. So with that, uh, guys, I really want to thank you all very much again. And I hope you will stick with me until I have some more CDI stuff. In the meantime, is there something else that I can do that people have been asking me about lately? Let's see. Well, there is this thingy I can uh, do. Remember this? Vintage Video Game Geek once gave me this and uh, we can do another round of Name That Ripoff with this one. Although I will change it up a bit, but uh, yeah, look forward to this one soon. I dug that one up. So guys, until next time, uh, thank you for watching and see you guys later. Take care.